How is it going guys? Today I brought you some very hot news from outstanding coin auction held at Heritage titled The Misfits Collection of US Error Coinage. The first part of that showcase auction. Overall amount of realized sales is over $250,000. So before getting started very quick if you first time on our channel, make sure to hit subscribe and bell buttons below this video to get daily updates on coin prices. Starting with this undated Canada of dollar struck on a copper cent planchet, grade that means day 62 brown by PCGS. The strike is moderately well centered on a small cent planchet with all border legends and the date well of the flat. Each side displays satiny olive brown and chestnut patina, with hints of rose and blue seen when angled beneath the light. Sold on November 21, 2022 for $2,880. Moving on to the 1960 Washington Quarter struck on a cent planchet, graded at mint state 64 red and brown by PCGS. Due to difference in sizes, flans obtained very odd shape and left part of motto and the lower part of the date dissolve into void as a result of that. Sold on November 21, 2022 for $1,680 at Heritage Auctions. Here is 1962D Franklin Half Dollar Double Struck Second Strike 70% of Center Grade that means day 60 by NGC Brilliant satiny mint luster characterizes this mint state error coin The initial strike was in color with full reading around the edge The second strike is of center toward 2 o'clock with only about lower left quadrant of the design reproduced Sold on November 21, 2022 for $11,400 at Heritage Auctions. And this is wartime nickel, 1943p 5 cent at extremely fine condition, struck on a copper nickel planchet. As you know, all Jefferson nickel struck in 1943 were supposed to be issued on silver alloy planchets to conserve copper and nickel for the war effort. However, a few leftover copper nickel planchets from 1942 were inadvertently fed into presses in 1943. This is distinct from its silver alloy counterparts due to its patina, which retains a pleasing olive grey hue as opposed to the typically dark appearance of war nickels. Sold on November 21, 2022 for $7,800. Jumping onto the 2000p Sacagawea dollar struck on Washington Quarter Planchet, graded at means day 67 by NGC. Radiant, brilliant luster illuminates unabraded surfaces on this piece with sharp central devices and strong cartwheel bands on each side. The rims are not fully defined as is a byproduct of the smaller quarter planchet. The strike is well centered. Sold on November 21, 2022 for $7,800. At heritage auction. This is 1921 piece dollar double struck and rotated in color. Damaged coin with AU details. Most double struck or rotated double strikes seen are out of color, so it's unusual to see this piece with complete reeded edge struck in the color. The first strike is largely obscured by the second strike, although the first impression is visible on Liberty's neck and around the outer border. Sold on November 21, 2022 for $6,600. Yet another wartime nickel, 1942 P. Jefferson nickel, with double denomination struck on a penny planchet. Grade that means they 64 brown by PCGS. This war nickel was struck on a copper cent. Lincoln is nearly inverted relative to Monticello. The outline of his head is readily evident. The truncation of his coat arcs across E Pluribus Uno. On the obverse, the NT from the scent is apparent on Jefferson's cheek. Sold on November 21, 2022 for $5,760 at Heritage Auctions. Here is undated New Orleans Morgan dollar struck 30% of center. Graded as AU53 by NGC. AU means about uncirculated. This O mint silver dollar was struck widely of center towards 630. The date is of the flan as is Ted states of AM. But Liberty's head is complete and is the rees and the eagle except for the wingtips. Iplurubus unum and one dollar are also complete. There are no mentionable marks across the medium gum metal gray surfaces. The eagle's breast 
As a hair above the ear confirm a brief stint in commerce despite the coin's unconventional appearance. Sold on November 21, 2022 for $10,200. And for the last, the most expensive lot of set showcase auction. 2,000 Lincolns and struck on 2,000 P Virginia Statehood Quarter. Grade that means state 66 by PCGS. So-called 11 cent denomination errors appear occasionally on the market, but the 26 cent examples are rare and even more desirable on a statehood type. Lustrous and essentially pristine with medium sea green and chestnut gold toning, the scent is struck about 15% of center toward 2 o'clock and 4 o'clock relative to the statehood side of the quarter. Sold on November 21, 2022 for $26,400 at Heritage Auctions.